Well, my demands are met. I'm getting the hell out of here. Hold it! Why don't you turn around and put the gun on the ground? Or I'll blow my brains all over this hallway! You're not the only one who could play hostage. You think I won't? You think I won't? Do you think we won't? Just shoot me! It isn't Bivington Bradwick. Mr. VIP himself. Or was it VVIP? I lost track after you put me in a cage! Listen, I know things got weird at that party. Between you and me, Susan really knows how to kill a vibe, you know? <laughs> and me! She killed me! Like a bunch of times! At the tea talk, I saw! I was like, what? What? <laughs> you know? Man! I mean, Susan hired me to trap you, but that was just so not namaste. So I totally get that you're feeling a little... Like, so many feelings, but mainly feeling a little... Pissed? Sure. Look, you've got the wrong impression of me. I first thought you were a fame-thirsty idiot. But look at everything you've done here. That's brains. Literally, brains. You don't know who I am, where I've been, the things I've seen. I was in prison. For 30 minutes. Ugh. That's amazing. Like, that's the kind of experience that can really impress Silver Spoon investment brats. Like you? Oh! Not unlike me. <sighs> Look, you've been a pathetic nobody hustler for your whole life. You're so low on the ladder, Susan Coldwell's only keeping you alive as leverage. She doesn't care about your potential. But I do. Put down the talking gun and let me make you a superstar, Octavio. Let me make you a real VIP. You're making a mistake! Big mistake! Huge! Oh god. Oh god. Oh Jesus. Uh, I'm checking this wall directory, but every room looks the same! Oh yeah, tell me about it! I get lost here all the time! Wait a minute! We're not on the same side! Don't move! Flavor calming technique. <laughs> Peanutty buddy. <laughs> Cuckoo coconut. <laughs> Razzmatazz radish. Right! Right, that flavor was discontinued. I'm so sorry. <laughs> I'm Octavio. <laughs> You're angry. <laughs> but I accept you. Huh? <laughs> huh? 
We boning? What? 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 Where's Anu? After your horrendous torture, Susan mentioned taking your sister to a lab. Is that where you're going? I was going... You know, I don't know where I was going. I sort of picked up this gun and walked around. Well, let's just kick down every door until we find her. Door number 108. Where's my sister? Uh, oh. This is Susan's office. Hot. Diggity donuts. Yep. Did that improve your mood? A little. Well, spread out! There's gotta be something in here that'll tell us where to find Anu. Sure thing, but before we do that... You're special to me. I know. So special. Thanks. I'm giving you an air hug. <laughs> I'm giving you one back. Guns can fall that I would. Lower your feelings are disgusting. Come on. Louis, guard the door while we look around. Affirmative. I'll stay here and summon the guards with my mind. You can do that? No, but I can try. <laughs> I can try! <laughs> oh, shit. Louis, can you plug yourself into a terminal here? Why would I do that? So you can access the mainframe and find Anu? Oh, so you think just because I'm a robot, I can plug myself into a terminal? We're both machines. Machines love plugging themselves into machines. That's... I, I didn't mean... A little reductive, don't you think? It's these ignorant, anti-mechanistic attitudes that hurt robots everywhere. I'm sorry. I never meant to offend you. It's okay. I, these confrontations just tend to drain my battery. I'm going to go plug myself into the first socket I see. Ah! Who wants to give me an oil bath? Vaultlander? Who would leave a Vaultlander lying on me? You fell right into my perfectly laid trap. No, I didn't. You fell from an air duct. Did I? Yes. Well, now you have to hang out with me. Because of the trap, that's the rule. Hey, I know that weirdo. He's obsessed with Vaultlanders. And we're playing. And if I win, you have to live in the air duct and breathe asbestos. You've been breathing asbestos? Let's play! Select your ball lander. Mordecai. Mordecai versus Handsome Jack. Fight! Ho ho! <laughs>
You won! Most impressive. You have learned all I can teach you. You didn't teach me anything. And now, I shall disappear into the unknown. What are you talking about? <coughs> are you trying to crawl in the air duct? You can't see. It's too smoky. <sighs> I forgot. Humans are slow. Wow! This office is amazing! This is your first time in Susan's office? Oh, no, I mean, it's amazing how this office never changes. Because I spend so much time in here. <laughs> because I'm such close personal friends with Susan Caldwell. We, um, we, we have a time share together. It's, 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 it's really exclusive. Um, we go together like peanut butter and guns. Chunky peanut butter and bullets. Guns. Ooh, I feel like I'm sweating bullets in here. <laughs> Any ideas on how we can find Anu? Yeah. Shh. Computer! Find Anu. Find Anu. That's all I got. Base directory. Where's Anu? The rash goes. It's a decoy computer. <laughs> no, no, no. No button tells me what to do. Get a load of big suits. What an ugly mug. Would be a real shame if someone broke her face. A real shame. Her fingers slipped. Friend! 
Did I do that? <laughs> Is this... Susan's Equidex? The Supreme Deluxe Model! Ultra-thin titanium bezel, 12 cameras, long-lasting iridium battery. This isn't even in stores yet. Ark, let me just try one app. Ooh, TDR Friend Maker. I wonder what it does. Oh, uh, we don't have time for you to make friends. Let me at least try one button. If I can find a terminal, I can probably track Anu through the surveillance system with this baby. Let's see what we got on your background, Fran. Uh, most likely to burst the blood vessel. Impressive. True. Uh, most likely to port the principal? Less impressive. But true. Um, I think we're done. Let's see what we can dig up on old Brock. He's writing a book? There's my memoir. Eat, pray, gun. One sentient firearms journey through life, love, and spiritual fulfillment. And how he became better for it. And how he shot a lot of stuff along the way. That's a really long title. I'm looking for constructive notes. Okay. Anybody else want to punch something for no reason? Who wants to give me an oil bath? He's doing stand-up sets at every comedy club in Promethea? The Ha Ha House? Captain Korn's Chuckle Hut? Promethea Penitentiary? Wow! Wait, what's this? He's got a sitcom greenlit? Where's my bounty? Put in the ass in ass ass a nation. Premiering this fall on PBC, I'm so gonna watch that. I'm still a fan of the shooting you all in the head idea. Ooh, I can scrub the surveillance system and find Anu. <laughs> Password protected? Of course. Just guess it! That never works. She likes money. Try money. That's stupid. Try money. <sighs> it didn't work. Needs a number. Try money one. <sighs> Forget it. Try millions of money. Big box. Bitch of box of bags of moolah. Dough. Lots of dough. Cashola, give me moolah. 777, I don't know why, just like seven. All right, let me just hack into the terminal with Susan's fancy new Equidex. No, wait, my fancy new Equidex. So sleek, so powerful, so expensive. The ultimate symbol of a true VIP. Just holding it, I feel like a boss. <laughs> Such a boss. Such a boss. I'm a boss. I'm forgetting myself. I need to hack this thing. Curse you, sexy Equinox. All right, now with Susan's firewall, this could take... I'm in! <laughs> Lightning fast! Never leave me, fancy Equinox. Never. What are you doing? <sighs> it's mine. You can't tear us apart. It's not my type. 
We're here for the terminal. Right, the terminal. Looks like they're keeping Anu in a lab. Here, Sector Zeta. That's an Omega. That's what I said. Are we ready to rescue Anu and get the fudge out of here? It's hero time. You said I'm fixed here, but I'm not. And I can't be who I want to be out there until I make peace with who I really am and what I've done. And I'm starting with you. You told everyone on Promethea you took a job at Atlas so you could change the world. I wanted to be seen changing the world. I never pondered what that actually meant. You can adapt, Danu. Grow. I always saw that. Which is why I think I hired you. Or why I think you think you hired me. Right. Exactly. But the truth is... I took the job because I was desperate for approval and acceptance. My acceptance? Yes. In a way, I admired you. You're a hero, an entrepreneur. Keep going. The people you deem intelligent? Did you really need me to tell you you're intelligent? No. I always knew that. I just didn't trust it. Then, do you need me? A manifestation of your boss to tell you to trust yourself? No. I could do that on my own. You're seeing yourself more clearly now. wall is a construct of my own mind. It's just a mental barrier. <sighs> what? My face walks through it! Oh, oh, face walk! Oh, oh, face walk! Oh. You know who else face walks? Lilith the Siren. Lilith face walks. I face walk. Transitive property. My guts undefiled by a rapturous load. You don't have to talk like that here. Say what you mean. You killed me. It was self-defense. It was murder. I never intended. Intention? The violence remains. I thought darkness only lurked in other people, bad people. But it's also within me. You're proof of that. You reflect. Give your sin meaning. That is courage. I don't usually like 
like the corporate types, but there's just something about it. Wanna get tacos? Okay. Can't face walk this. I always dreamed of being a siren. And this is a lucid dream space. Maybe I can also... Face grasp! <gasps> You know what, though, Missy? You're no better than that Susan Coldwell, if you ask me. You're both playing with, with power you don't understand. Stealing corpses as research for her secret project. You trapped me in a coffin. Clearly we had some trust issues. Unless specified, the dead don't belong to you, or me, or science. On a planet surrounded by death, the dead deserve respect. If we don't, how could we ever respect life? Now you're getting it! Okay, uh, no platforms, nothing to grab. I guess the only thing I could possibly do is... <gasps> oh, okay, Anu, you got this. <gasps> In here, you're a siren. In here, you can... makes us capable of something else. What's that? Compassion, reflection, and ultimately, change. <sighs> I've been so obsessed with this device as the solution. So obsessed with solving the universe's pain, I didn't even see the pain right in front of me. Listen, V. 
very carefully. I need you to watch over this woman. She, or what's inside her, is the most valuable object in the universe right now. Far more valuable than you. Do I make myself clear? Clear. Mm hmm I am going to the bridge to determine why in the seven hells somebody prematurely launched our ship back into space! How your pistol whip. Really wish you didn't demonstrate with me. I knew! Free! I'm free! Free at last! Get me skippy kaye, mother truckers! Leave, lady, alone! Scanning, you are so lucky I don't know your face or name. I don't need a name to knock this one's head off. You want a death day? Have a bullet for a pretty picnic! Whoa, 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 whoa! We can both come out of this ahead. There's gotta be something you want, right? Lady... My sister? Pick something else. Sister? Yeah, yeah. You jackasses weren't holding me prisoner because I'm important. You just knew Anu wouldn't want anything to happen to her brother. Laugh it up! Octavia doesn't matter! Ha ha ha! So funny! Uh, something you want to talk about, Oc? Don't care about Oc! Care about pretty lady Anu! Show her vault lander! And keep away from Thugman! Bad guy dressed as a bad guy! Yeah. Threat neutralized! Not threat, friend! Friend? Keep the vault lander! Buzz a buddy token! Buzz a buddy token. It would appear this TDR guard is previously acquainted with Anu. And may also be a psycho. Not psycho anymore! Why would a psycho bandit sign up to be a corporate foot soldier? Free gym membership! Great! Awesome! Let's get her out of here! Great! Awesome! Came here to rescue her also! Thought you were trying to kill her! Glad we clear up comical misunderstanding! Yeah, not that comical. It was a little bit comical. Anu! <sighs> you can help me up now. Yeah. Oh, oh, headache. <clears throat> uh, I know this isn't a great time, but I sort of shot myself in the leg. You sort of shot yourself in the leg? I shot myself in the leg, all right? Why did you shoot yourself in? Can you just heal it, please? Give me that zap zap. Thanks, Bunches. Hey, don't judge. When we were fooling around, you shot friend, remember? That's because you forced me to. That's all right. You can shoot me as much as you want. Wow. <laughs> I forgot how much better a non-shot leg feels. How do you two know each other? Long story. Short version, we are friends. Very will they, won't they? I see. Have you two had a uh, mouth to mouth? No. Why? No reason. You were comatose for a while. Is your brain malfunctioning? I had such a cool dream. I was a siren. Now, headache. That is not healthy. Anu? Anu, wait. Who are we dealing with? Is it Anu or that shard spirit thing? Huh. 
Is it me? Is it me? Is it me? <laughs> Staple face knows this feel. I don't know. Test me. Ask me something I, Anu, would have a strong reaction to. How heavy is your Healy gun? It is not a gun! Okay, I'm still me! Well done, well done. <laughs> Space, not, <laughs> not the app. What? How was I supposed to know? Who puts a button like that on their Echo Dex? Okay, okay, that's on me. I'll take the L. But I can fix this. There's definitely an unlaunch button here. And Viola! A new idea. We all find escape pods immediately. You don't have to tell me twice. I hate space, and I hate this corporate dump. I'm not leaving. <laughs> Hilarious bit. Woman who won't leave. <laughs> so good. Okay, let's go. We can't. Why the hell not? We sure as mother can. You find an escape pod, get in the escape pod, and escape. I'm not leaving while the shard is still inside me. And to be honest, I'm not sure I can leave while the shard is still inside me. Wow, you really are hard up on being the special sparkle princess. This is bigger than me. At this range, Susan can use her shard in her doomsday machine. She'll destroy Promethea. What? No! All my stuff is there! <gasps> Things you own, own you. When you say doomsday machine, A larger, more powerful iteration of our own device that some cool, but not intimidatingly cool scientist kind of, sort of, tricked me into creating for her. A big, giant, humongous, super gun. Super device. Actually, yeah, in this case, it's a gun. Okay. Okay. How do we stop her? In Atlas, we operated our highest level weapons from the ship's bridge. It also controls ship's flight path! Data your training, leave fun fat to staple base brain. Our mission is clear. Storm the bridge. Kill or knock out Susan. And return these shards where they belong. It sounds like the perfect plan. Except the bridge is the most fortified section of the ship, defended by swarms of TDO guards, drones, turrets, exploding toilets, and filthy data ports that lie about their age and don't text you back. I'm just guessing about the last one. Don't worry about getting to bridge. Staple Face has plan. I hate this plan. <laughs> but also friends. Wait, so they're your prisoners, each other's friends, and you have direct orders to take them to the bridge? Y yes Okay, move now. Hold her right 
there! I'm calling this in. Nobody move! We probably should not let them call this in. Now we're definitely calling this in! Emergency lockdown protocols above staple faith in paper! ideas. It'll take sophisticated technology to interface to demagnetize the seal. What about beep boop pep? You know, beep boop pep, your echo decks. You think beep boop pep is a sound for my echo decks? Just use your echo decks. Oh yeah, I can do that. <laughs> I can honestly say this is not how I saw my week going. You and me both. I suppose it'll be over soon. One way or the other. Hopefully a good way. And not the other. I mean badly. I hope it doesn't end badly. Oh, I'm coming in. <clears throat> My shin. Don't spoil it. Okay. But turn on Susan's voice disguises. It's a hit and a half. <laughs> Octavio! He got him all peaches. All right, clowns! End of the line! I don't care what Susan says! <laughs> Shoot the kill! I think we should let him finish them off. This seems really important to him. He's gonna be so tuckered out later. Poor little guy. <laughs> Bombastic, braggadocious behavior. So you give murder robots a bad name. <laughs> GG, well played. A friend in range. Huh? Of course! Did your friend make her? Susan doesn't use the app to call friends. She uses it to make and remake friends. Don't you see? What? I'm still hip. I still get technology. I wonder if I can customize the settings and give it a dark theme. Just use your stupid echo dumper! Friend code scanned. I brought an Echo Dex to a gunfight. Why can't I shoot you? Why can't I shoot you? Your safety is permanently on. I have a gun that can't shoot? Technically, you're not even a gun. Teteor doesn't register you as a weapon anymore. Maybe don't shoot people. <laughs> Enjoy your life as a paperweight. <laughs> now that we're finally about to face the boss of Tedior, I've been processing our friendships. Ugh! 
here they are. Anu, get the next door. On it. When I first met you all, I believed you were all disgusting, inefficient sacks of flesh, walking animals with no purpose other than converting food to feces. Great story, Lee. Fran, close the door. Well, that's no good. Die, door! To our next in crab room done. Stop using that voice. <gasps> it's jammed. No, no. Elbow juice. I like her. That psycho trainer's with them too. <laughs> we call that. An adrenaline smoke! Get it open! It's stuck! And you are snapping at me. We talked about this. Anytime now, on your situation's getting critical! Anu. Um. You were an anxiety-ridden corporate shill. You were afraid of your own shadow. Oh, Anu, get the next door. Why do I always get the hard ones? There has to be a weakness here somewhere. I'll find it. Now you're a heroic example to humanity, courageously standing up to evil. Even if it means you'll definitely, absolutely die. Goggle, goggle! Why did I just say that? Slay, queen. Scanning. Scan complete. It's a door. I know! I need an opening before we all die! Uh, increase magnification. Zooming for clues. Sometimes the best way to find things is to make everything bigger. Well said. <laughs> Why am I talking to goggles? Because a good friend can be right in front of your eyes. Like me. I'm right in front of your eyes. <laughs> I know. <laughs> oh, what do we have here? Zooming, enhancing, composition analysis, door composed of 64% door fibers, 35% various door materials, 1% door handle. Not helpful. You try being scanning goggles. Increase magnification! I'm zooming. I'm zooming. That's all you want from me. Zooming. Enhancing. Yes! Now zoom! I'm enhanced! Zooming. Enhancing. Magnification at atomic level. Oh, look at all the little door molecules. Can we break through them with hard enough hits? You want to hit the molecules? They didn't do anything to... Increase the zoom! We need flaws, gaps, inconsistencies, anything! Zoom all the way in! Affirmative. Approaching maximum zoom. We're zooming where no goggles have zoomed before. Zooming. Enhancing. Magnification at the quantum level. Warning. Things are about to get weird. I've seen weird before. At this point, nothing can surprise to me. Iridium particles permit him to exist in multiple dimensions at the quantum level. He's trying to say something. What's he saying? Scanning. Pull? Pull Van der Waals force through a quantum state? Pull apart covalent bonds from the door molecules? Pull. The door handle? That was my next guess. The door handle. <sighs> Tell no one about this. I can't promise that. Guys, I just opened the extremely difficult, complicated door. Staple face. You 
can fix this, right? You can make her okay? I don't know. I, I can try. No. No time. Time is delicious. Dynamic thermolock. I I've read about these, but I never thought I'd actually see one in the wild. A fluid dilly what now? This is bleeding edge security. By using a series of hydraulic pumps, the door's lock must be depressurized by balancing a precise volume of liquid at a perfect temperature. It's adjusted by dispensing viscous door fluid from those handles. But with this many variables, the number of permutations is... 4,088,300,031. Oh, wait. Thirty-two. I forgot to round the decimal. This isn't even fair. This is impossible. Pouring! Frozen yogurt. You kids. Stand back! Mama Fran's about to pour the most important yogurt of her life. In an out of control world. Who for you? The door is open, and I just made the perfect cup of yogurt. My goodness. You are majestic, Francine. When we first met, early data concluded that you were in the throes of a midlife crisis, sublimating rage-induced insecurities into mediocre desserts. But now, I see you are comfortable and confident, being much, much, much older than everyone else. 
Oh, saved by the gunfire! <laughs> I love being in danger with you all. <laughs>